I don't know. Nobody knows. Irwin's gone. Irwin's gone. So what? I want my Irwin. <laughs> Calling all Irwins, calling all Irwins, calling all Irwins. This is Mrs. Irwin Trowbridge, number 62 Dobbins Drive. I wish to report a missing person. My husband, he didn't come home last night. I told you not to marry him, didn't I? Remember what I said to you? I said, don't marry him. Try to locate Irwin. Yes, Mr. Collins. Call the police department. Yes, Mr. Collins. Call the lost and found. Yes, Mr. Collins. Call the hospital. Yes, Mr. Collins. And don't forget the psychopathic ward. Yes, I mean no, Mr. Collins. My soul was sad as darkest night, but now the world seems fair and bright because you came so true and fine. Oh, stay and be my valentine. We had a long talk, Irwin and I, and I'm convinced the guy's a genius. He looks screwy to me. Shower, so you'll be in shape to pick the horses today. Horses? You go and get straightened out. Meanwhile, I count the money I owe you. Money? A hundred and twelve dollars, I think it is. Do you mean to say I made a hundred and twelve dollars just picking the horses? That's right. Well, that's fine. And if I picked them today, I might make that much again? Then you mean you'll pick them? Yeah. I'd like to. Very much. I'll just go in here and change my clothes. No, not hey, just hey, 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 is that so? Well, how about these women? Yes, sir. What are, what are they to you? But it's so easy to explain. It's only a hobby. Only a hobby? Oh, Erwin! There's the key to your character, Erwin Trowbridge. Most people would be satisfied with collecting stamps or butterflies, but not you. Oh, no. You have to have women. Oh, no. 